Sorry, you know my first question. How long have you been growing that beautiful man mane of mullet hair out? Almost two years now. I started it before sophomore season, the PAW season. And I occasionally have to trim it for like PAW tournaments, but off season it gets long and luscious like it is now. Who has better hair, you or Robbie Howard? Oh, I don't know. I wish I'm, I'm, I'm thinking about growing out to get some formula too with braids in the bag, maybe. Who knows? So what inspired that? Uh, actually, I mean, I started growing out a little bit and had like a little flow. And then one of my friends from Club Cole Wilson was like, you should go to mall. And I was like, that's brilliant. And I just started growing it and then it just stuck. You got to trim the side. If you want a true mullet, you're yes, going to have to trim yeah. those sides. It's a little too much business on the top here for like a true, true <laughs> mullet. But I like it, so. All right, two matches straight there in the finals. Uh, look pretty dominant to me. Uh, coming out here, getting it done in two. How huge is that for you? I mean, yeah, it just felt good. I mean, I was just a good wrestler, and I felt, I felt you know, I dominated my offense, and it just felt good. I mean, my offense has been going good all tournament, and I feel good about it. You're a big volume shooter. Was that the game plan coming into this? I mean, yeah, that's how I train, that's how I wrestle. You know, that's just I wear them out, and everything. You know, I, I, knew, I know I can't score the first, I can just score the second because he's tired. And I'm shooting a lot of shots. How have you been able to develop the ability to wrestle that hard? Uh, I mean, I mean, just training hard. I mean, and I feel like. I'm doing what everyone else is doing, you know, just running and drilling. I don't know, it's just my gas tank and I'm thankful for it. You got you win for Nats, but you take a loss at the Northeast Regional. What did you take away from that and what happened there? Oh, uh, I mean, I just, I know, uh, I got dragged and he got in me four times. You know, I got uh, these past two, three weeks, however, I've been just working b bottom because I haven't wrestled like too, too much freestyle in these past two years and I've been working on my bottom and it's gotten a lot better. First world championship for you? Yes, it is, yeah. You're on the Pan Am team, but it's a little different, right? Yeah. The whole world's at this. Yeah, I know. What do you got to do to, to not medal, but go to win a, you know, a world championship, a gold medal for the United States? I mean, my main thing is when I shoot on my shots, a lot of times, even in like my semifinal, final, I almost got tossed with four because my finishes aren't as clean as it should be. And like when I get in, I sometimes hang my leg. And even Rogers, he uh, chin, I uh, like, to, like roll me and I just have to finish my shots quicker so I don't give up them too. Alright, well keep keep growing the growing the glorious mullet. Represent the United States with a with a strong mullet. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you.